Hi, this is Rebecca. And I'm Megan. Together we are Lark and Poe. From Atlanta, Georgia, and we are here with Backstage Broadcast to talk about a couple of our favorite records. First and foremost, we have Fleetwood Mac Rumors. This goes back to our childhood. This is our, what our dad was playing for us ever since I can remember. And it's just been a really important record for us. Um, it's instilled in us a love of classic rock music. Absolutely. Stevie Nicks, she has such a mystical vibe on stage when she performs, and all the guitar work of Lindsey Buckingham is a big inspiration for us when we arrange our songs. Like on here, I would say Never Going Back Again was a song that was really important for me. I loved it, made me want to learn it on guitar. Mm hmm Yep. Do you have a favorite song? Um, the Chain is um, one song that we've actually done covers of on stage. Yeah. We've, we've had a lot of fun with that one. It's just a beautiful, all around a beautiful band. I mean, look at them. They're just gorgeous. And um, the other record that we picked, um, we had to do Elvis Costello's My Aim is True. We're going to be going out on the road with Elvis in just a couple of weeks, actually, on the West Coast for his detour tour. And we played with him on stage so many of these songs. We've played Watching the Detectives with him, Allison, Blame It on Kane. We actually did our own version of Blame It on Kane mm -hmm. for Lock and Poe shows. We've and done the, the Angels Wonder Where My Angels. And, and Mystery we've, Dance, we've done. And we've heard all of these many, <laughs> many times live. So this is an important one for us. Such a classic record. <laughs> this is one of our favorites. So this is some music that's dear to our hearts. We hope that you guys continue to go out and support music and buy records, especially from places like this mecca of music. So once again, we're Lark and Pope. Thank you so much. So hi, my name is Kate Nash, and this is In Utero by Nirvana, which is uh, one of my all-time favorite albums. But if I suppose this is the one to talk about today. Um, and, I, and I love it. I mean, this album's just nearly flawless. I, if you put a gun to my head and asked me to pick a folk band, I'd say The Weeknd. 